Google's artificial intelligence is going to make you the Picasso of clip art. AutoDraw is a new site at autodraw.com by Google. It gives users a host of drawing tools to roughly sketch out an image to the best of their ability. So if you're not a very good artist, you still you use this tool to draw out that thing that you're trying to draw. When using the AutoDraw tool, Google's AI will analyze the image being drawn with every stroke that you add and update a series of thumbnail images up at the top uh, that it thinks match the item that's being sketched. If it's what the user wants, they just tap one of those thumbnails and their piece of junk is turned into a piece of art. I love this. Um, I encourage everyone to go to autodraw.com right now and spend as much time as you have on autodraw. Quick draw is something that they did before. That was that was old. But autodraw.com, uh, I spent some good time with it. I am not a good artist. Uh, and uh, I, I tweeted it out. You can easily tweet out the images. Uh, so, so Brian's trying it here. What are you, you going to draw, what do you think Brian? Brian's going to draw a dog. Uh, hat. Is it a hat. No. Google thinks a it's turtle. a mushroom. It thinks it's pants. It thinks it's a bathtub. It uh, thinks this is a, this is a bed. It's a, a bed. It's oh, a, it's a dog. It's a, a dog. hippopotamus. Like I said, I know. There's the dog. You see the dogs up? You can see the dogs up top? Oh, hippo. It's a hi of course it's a hippo. But they doesn't know it's a hippo, so it's not a good hippo. Maybe that, do you see it? You can choose up top. I, yeah, no, I, think I know. Got the teeth. It's a good hippo. That was the problem, too. Nathan, like Brian, you are both good artists. So you actually. <laughs> No, not a wiener dog. <laughs> yeah. Not a wiener dog. So, uh, yeah. Not a boxer, right. a bear. So, so it takes takes what you draw and it tries to guess and then gives you shapes and so that you can auto-insert those shapes that are drawn better, well, potentially better than what you drew in there. Well, I think the AI is based on bad artists like myself. <laughs> um, that's what I've found. There's some really, so yeah, you save it, you can tweet it out or share it um, on whatever social media uh, that you have. Um, I went to hashtag auto draw on Twitter and found so many pictures of penises. I'm sorry, drawings, <laughs> but that's what you find there <laughs> immediately. Oh, the and Google doesn't, Google doesn't recognize it. Um, it doesn't give you, <laughs> <laughs> no. well, it's kind it doesn't of like, give you a fleshed out version of that. No, no, no it doesn't. Also, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> That was a bad pun. Uh, it doesn't. But I find that like when I'm just doodling, like sometimes it does look like a penis. Yeah. So I don't know why. <laughs> it's just, it just what does. What were you drawing earlier? Because you dog. were drawing something. I was drawing a dog. You're right. It did kind of look like that. <laughs> but it, also it didn't recognize. I also, someone tweeted, tried to draw a picture of a cigarette uh -huh. and it didn't recognize that. It just didn't show. Like, and I tried it too. I tried a very realistic picture of a cigarette and it didn't show that, which is fine. I guess guess but then it's like they're already like you know it's like someone was in charge of saying like hey we don't want people to be able to draw cigarettes like cigarettes are a part of art like i don't you know it's it's That's one true. of those things where you get where like oh google you're all up in my business making the choices that i want to make myself they're protecting us from the better drawn versions of some of these things smoking we just is dangerous about. it causes cancer etc yeah. but yeah. i i don't want sometimes it's like, you want to draw a cigarette sometimes you want to maybe you want to draw a cigarette to say don't smoke yeah that's true that's a really mm -hmm. good point um yeah and i had never heard of this it, apparently this was an extension of another google like a related google service called quick draw mm -hmm. where you go to the site and it's actually kind of fun it gives you a word it says draw a wristwatch in this case in under 20 seconds so you have 20 seconds to draw a wristwatch you do this six times with six different things and then they they sick their artificial intelligence their you know their their computers mm -hmm. on this to see if it can figure out what you drew to, to match it up. And, you know, you're trying to make sure that you draw it well enough that their AI can match it. And so they took kind of some of the lessons that they learned out of this experience, this project, and brought it in mm -hmm. uh, to auto-draw. So just another way that AI is making us better at things than, than we were without it, apparently. Well, it's making some people. Like, it's not making people who are artists, like Brian or Svetlana, who is a graphic artist. Like, mm -hmm. it's not going to make, you know, she's... It's better. It's not as good as what she draws because that is character. It's not artificial intelligence. Right. Yeah. This this really it seems to be for for people who do not consider themselves to be good artists. Right. If you right. just want to make a poster or something, yeah, like exactly. a, not a non-smoking poster, but any <laughs> other poster, <laughs> some, not a poster. Some with conditions apply. On it either. <laughs>